Hello there monsters and men, ladies and people, and welcome to Recharging and welcome to a very dark Germany. Yes, I say Germany, so you know what that means, a top speed range test, and this time with the Kia EV6. The Kia EV6 that is standing over here is the one with the bigger battery pack, so 77 kilowatt hours and rear wheel drive. So the version with the longest range. And when driving normally, you can do over 400 kilometers with this car. But what can it do when you drive top speed? To be honest, I don't even know what the top speed is yet of this car, but I think it is around 180 kilometers an hour. But hey, there's one way to find out, right? Today's conditions are not optimal. It is a bit damp, it is a bit foggy. The car has winter tires, the roads are wet. It is around five degrees. So again, not optimal, but we will do the test anyway. The car is being charged to 90% and lucky for me, that goes really fast with this car. And then off we go. So the car is charged to 91% and we are approaching the Autobahn. And as I said, I have no idea what the top speed is of this car so let's find out here's the stop sign there's nothing coming again it is damp it is foggy the roads are wet it is five degrees approaching the autobahn it's very dark holy crap let's steer yeah and power as i said it is the rear wheel drive version so not the all-wheel drive version with the most power but still I think he does 0 to 100 in about 7 seconds and we are already doing 150 and we are going quick as hell. I can't see shit. Maybe this is not the safest thing to do in the whole world. 186, 87, 190. It's not 180, it is 190. That is quick. And there goes the music. Sorry for that. <laughs> that was not the plan. Oh, there was one with headlights. Yep. Let's do that too, because that is a whole lot safer. All right, let's cruise. I gotta be honest, I need quite some focus while driving 191 kilometers an hour in the dark. But anyway, I have used almost 25% state of charge and I have driven around 40 kilometers on that. So 25 times four is 100%. 40 times 4 is around 160 kilometers. It is getting a bit loud in here, but hey, we are driving 190 kilometers an hour, so it is not a fault of the car. But I will keep on driving, I will keep on focusing, and go, 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 go! I don't know what happened, because the top speed was 191 kilometers an hour. I could drive that, but when I reached around 63% state of charge, the car suddenly slowed down and now I cannot drive any faster than 180 kilometers an hour. I don't know if that is because of the top speed, uh, I mean because of the battery percentage, or because maybe the battery is overheating a little bit. I don't know, it is strange, but well, it happened. I mean 180 kilometers an hour is still very quick. All right, I am at my turnaround point. I wanted to say that I've used 50% state of charge, but I don't. I actually have used 40, calculate, 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 44% state of charge. And I've driven 72.6 kilometers and my consumption is absolutely terrible. That is, I think it is 49.6 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers, but the range still is around 160 kilometers and again the first 30 percent i had a top speed of 190 kilometers an hour and now i can only do 180 kilometers an hour still some strange behavior i don't know if it is a fault or a feature a bug or a feature but i don't know i don't know anyway let's get onto the autobahn and power Accelerating, accelerating, 100, 110, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, yep, 70, yeah, come on, Kia, you can do it, and 180, there we go. 
All right, so my state of charge is 30% and well, my top speed is basically 175 kilometers per hour right now. And if I go uphill, it is even less. So I have the feeling that at a certain battery percentage, the battery pack can only deliver a certain amount of power. So you have a certain amount of top speed. If you have a low state of charge, it is more 175 kilometers an hour. And if you have a higher state of charge, it is 191 kilometers an hour. I've never seen this behavior before, but yeah, it is interesting, let's say that. Yes, I made it, but the last 20 kilometers I actually drove slower than the top speed. I gotta be honest, the last 10 kilometers I was actually driving 90 kilometers per hour, otherwise I was afraid I wasn't going to make it. I mean, I arrived there at the charger with 2% state of charge, but we are charging now with 230 kilowatts, so that is good. And also, according to the specifications, this car can do 185 kilometers per hour. Well, if you ask me what is the top speed of the Kia EV6, I have to tell that it is somewhere between 175 and 191 kilometers per hour. I don't think it has anything to do with the battery overheating because, well, when I plugged the car in into the charger, I was getting 230 kilowatts, so the battery seems fine. So I think it is because, well, a battery with a lower state of charge can deliver a lower power output. I think it has to do something with that and maybe also some battery protection of Kia. But it is the first car I experienced this with and it is a bit odd, but also interesting. But again, I don't know why this is and why this happened, but it happened. Anyway, then the test. Again, at the end, I drove a bit slower but also the conditions are pretty shitty wet roads around five degrees winter tires so in slightly better conditions you can probably still get what i calculated right now so so i started the test with 91 percent state of charge and i finished the test with two percent so that means i've used 89 percent on those 89 percent i have driven 147 kilometers so if i do the calculation you can do while driving top speed with this Kia EV6 long range rear wheel drive, 165 kilometers. Maybe in summer you can stretch it to 180, 185, but it is around that 170-ish. So there you have it. The consumption was 44.5 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers, but while hammering top speed, it, is, it was around 50 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers. So there you have it, that is the result. Do with it what you want, you know the drill. Please give a like and it would be awesome if you subscribed. And then I would like to say now thank you a lot for watching and as always, to be continued.